guys, and welcome back to another episode of Illusion of the Gaia. Last we left off, we finished off the Mushroom Temple. We lost Hamlet. And we got to do, um, the Anchor Watt. We did... <laughs> Sorry. <coughs> we did quite a bit last episode. Would you happen to be Will? No. This is Dao, the Desert Village. Children don't come to places like this very often. Alright, first things first. I need to grab this. Red Jewel. Can I... I can't get rid of that. I can't get rid of that. Can't get rid of that. This ain't gonna... Let's do that so I don't accidentally use it. Then we go in here. We've got the snake beating game. Rules are simple. Hit as many snakes as you can in one minute. Hit whatever pot you like to start. And then, voila, this is the game. And it goes, I don't remember how long it goes for. But it's another time just thing. We just do this for 80 or 90 hits or so. And we'll get two red jewels. Let's see. The last recording that uh, we lost all the audio for had 88. Let's see if I can get 80, uh, more than 88. I'm going for the world record. 93! Woo! For your prize, I'll give you two red jewels. I'll send them to the jeweler. Okay, well, that should put us... That should put us up to 44. I have fine goods. Freedom movement has started recently. The president of Rolex started the labor trade freedom movement. This town is famous for spices and carpets. It's said the carpet took of Edward Castle took 40 years to weave here. Get at weave here. Who are you? The girl silently offers one sheet of paper. There was a picture of a jackal. A shiver ran down my spine. It was a warning from the jackal who had been stalking us. Man, I love how the music cuts out there. Have you ever played Snake Panic? I'm still in training for it. Yeah, I just killed 93 snakes. Hey, hey, this isn't a show. Get out of here. I guess he didn't understand what I said. His eyes were expressive. You've come all the way from this, uh, you've come all the way to this town to buy labor. I can't make up my mind if I should do business with you. You can't put a price on people. You literally have someone in the cage right now. She didn't understand. She just kept working. These women are weaving carpets. This will take almost 40 years to weave. This woman has worked on it continuously since she was a child. Remember, little man, some are born to misfortune. Or you're just a dick and you're blaming other people suffering uh, instead of on themselves in, in their birth instead of taking blame yourself. There's a huge pyramid near here. Many explorers have come for the treasure, but no one's found it yet. We're explorers. I hear there's a treasure inside the pyramid. The pyramid is made of huge stones. Strange that it doesn't sink into the desert. There's a strange legend around here. The pyramid is not for the living. Only those who've transcended the body may enter. These are the words. Uh, these are the words. The pyramid is a big tomb. The living can't go in. Hmm? Uh, where is the jeweler? Oh, okay, that's where we are. Oh, that's the jeweler there. Neil! Well, I never thought I'd meet you in a place like this. Neil, you've become the company president? Yes, I tried replacing the labor trade with pepper imports. <laughs> this led me all the way to the Tao. Uh, yes, we used to deal in human lives, but now we just deal in peppers. Will you do business with us? <laughs> There's a pyramid near here. I wonder if there are mystic statues there. Gee, I wonder. Uh, 44. I think that's right. Um... Well, let's talk to... I can't go outside in a sandstorm like this. 
This place is supposed to be famous for labor merchants. It doesn't look like it. Did you happen to be? Well, yes. Good, a letter and some luggage have arrived from someone named Bill and Lolo. Ba -ba -ba -ba. There should be five in this pyramid and then one in the final dungeon. You get a letter and your father's journal. Have you been okay? Neil told us that he was in Dao, so I'm sending this letter. I heard that the reason why Grandpa and I are looking forward to seeing you. When we looked into your father's luggage, we found a journal written about the pyramid. I thought it would help you, so I sent it along. Take care. Goodbye. Okay, so this... I've deciphered the hieroglyphs. No one has ever done it before. It says there's a key to solving the riddle of the human history in the pyramid. The first part says, the sun spirit rises from the horizon. I went to the pyramid and found the same inscription, so here's our page is missing. Alright, well, can I... I cannot discard that. Well, I'm gonna have to discard an herb. Because I need two inventory spots. That's... I'd say we're doing pretty good if we can have to do, clear some inventory. I haven't used a single herb yet. Yay! Defense up. Okay. And... Everyone gets to meet something. Meet... Shadow. A voice echoes inside his head. I've been waiting for you to come. I am made from the light of a comet. The ultimate warrior. Shadow. The Hedgehog. <laughs> My body has no shape. This body appears only when the human consciousness evolves. The comet that now approaches Earth is also a consciousness without form. My body is the only thing that can confront the comet and bring it to an end. Well, close your eyes. And watch the transformation sequence. There's Wills. And then... Poof! Shadows. That was... I am Gaia, the source of life. The dark power has become strong in the temple at Angkor Wat. If you stand before the right-hand statue, you can change into the shadow, the ultimate warrior. Then I think I will grant you one item. Well, I'm already turned into him. <laughs> you have the aura! Actually, need to clear up two spaces now that I think about it. The aura is Shadow's mind. When he holds it up, his body becomes like water. Only a small part of the pyramid is above ground. Most of it is below the surface. You should change into sh the shadow and advance into the underground. Well, uh, here we go. We're almost done. I'm also going to... Alright. Well, I'm not counting those as used because, well, all I did was throw them on the ground. Stomp on them a little bit. So, first things first, we go down here because... Whenever you see these brick patterns go into the, that deep into the ground, it means there's a hidden path. And we found a red jewel. Huzzah! Now, here's another thing. So these rooms, the, the pharaoh, these, if you notice, each room is marked by a symbol. A guard, a pharaoh, a guy with a boner. <laughs> Sorry, but that's what that looks like. Um, the the pharaoh is Will's rooms. The guards like this are uh, Frieden, and then the boner is Shadow. And no, it's not actually a boner, but it I believe it's supposed to be someone who kneels. We might as well get shadows out of the way, since, well, we just got shadow. I, now, I don't remember which rooms have it, but a couple rooms have uh, places to goop down like this. And there's a red jewel in it. So before I goop down every floor, I'm going to check 
There should be only two more that Shadow can get, and then the rest, uh, their other two are Wills. I know where one of them for sure is. For Will. Enemies defeated. Um, I think this is where it is. Oh, I missed the invisible enemy. Uh, I hate those. Yep, Red Jewel. Alright, one more for Shadow, and then... Now, the book shows the order you need to place the hieroglyphs in on the wall, but uh, it's literally just where you get them from. There we go. There's a hieroglyph in each of these rooms. Oh, I need to goop down over there. Okay. Oh, wait. Two enemies left. Down we go! Only one health point left. And then we've got max health. Oh god, these guys. So, their actual bodies are the mummy part. Once that breaks, these are just enemies that can, well, possess you. They don't... They do, like, one hit point of damage when they possess you, but... Still an annoyance. enemy up there we need to goop down and kill first. Whee! I wonder why I wasn't hidden. That was weird. This will allow us to drop down. And we're on the bottom floor. Swat dive! Alright. And it's time for the hieroglyph. There's a lithograph on the wall. I heard it's in Dao that it's a hieroglyph. Let's try to remove it. You've got the hieroglyph stone. I did it. I got it.
Bird. Down we go. One down. One, uh, one more shadow room to go. Now, Frieden's rooms are special in that almost all of Frieden's can be, I believe both of Frieden's rather, can be done by shadow. I don't know why they decided to do that, but it's whatever. I'd, I'd rather take each character into the room they're meant to be for the, uh, for the fun of it. So let's go into Shadow's other room. No invisible enemies. There's eight enemies on this floor. Why can't I? That is so weird. It wouldn't let me attack. Okay, well, whatever. Um, I'm unsure where the other room for Shadow is. Nope. Bloop. Hmm. I'm wondering if I'm wondering if it's just, you know, in the open. Like, am I gonna miss it? Maybe. Hey! Defense! I still am one health point away. I feel like I might have mi actually missed it. One treasure. Alright, so the other one's in here. I'll goop down if I don't find the gem. First things first. I like how you can knock enemies into other enemies and do damage. It's a nice feature. Look at all these guys. I got... Well, I know exactly where I need to drop down now. To our right. Oh, there it is, right there. Alright. Oh, I do not want to use an herb game. Stop trying to make me use an herb! Game's trying to cheat me out of my no herb use run. There it is, to our right. Okay. I need to drop down at the very top there. One I need to take Will into Freedens, and we'll do that first, and then the other one should just be in Will's area. Bloop! Please tell me this is the right one to drop down at. Looks like it, at least. Cool. Okay, no enemies. Uh, let's try to remove it. You got the hieroglyph stone! I did it! Haha. <laughs> yeah. Let's go put this one away. And then we turn into Will. I, I understand they wanted the mechanic of um, Shadow here. But I really wish that instead of having to goop down here every time it would just you know there'd be like a path or something down because you also when you have to goop down have to change your character after every dungeon so if you don't get the red jewel in freedoms with will you actually miss out on um a uh, power up too. 
that's taken us about 20 minutes to get through all this, so that's not bad. And this is where we're needed for well. Will you stop it? Thank you. Wee! And away. And there's an enemy hidden right here, so if you miss this, Red Jewel, you actually missed that power up too. Alright, well, away we go. Huzzah! Right, that's one for Will. And one more is all that's left in this tongue full. And that puts us up to 49 jewels. Pharaoh. Into the Pharaoh door. Um... Alright, let's go into this door to make sure we get everything before we go on. Ow. How did I... Oh, okay, I remember now. Ow! I got shot through the wall! Shot through the wall! It hurts like hell! And you need to be at the top of the stairs to do this. And that's why only Will can do this. Five left. Don't need to drop down there, because that just leads us back to the other area. And then, ha! Huh. Awesome. More defense! What are our stats up to? I don't think I've ever shown this off. Our stats, so you can see a little flip of the powers and stuff. But... And if you notice, those sprites are very similar to another game. I'll talk more about that in another episode. But, uh... You can't slide downstairs, for those wondering. And also, this is just really fun to do. I got stuck on there, but okay. Five more enemies, and none here. Ah! Okay, I remember also where Will's last one is. it off so hopefully you all are enjoying this series because I'm actually thinking about doing the other games in the trilogy uh, Soul Blazer and Terranigma next room is where we'll find the final red jewel. Now we gotta turn into shadow to be able to turn back into well and that's my biggest flaw with this dungeon. <laughs> So we're just holding uh, Shadow's brain in our hands. Don't don't mind the goopiness. <laughs> but, 
ba, 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 ba. All right. Back to Will. And then it's Freedom's turn. I definitely prefer being Freedom. I swear, if I missed the one uh, health power up somewhere, I'm gonna be so mad at myself. Alright, Will, room number two. Bullying me! 32 enemies! Oh, shit! Hmm. Well, that didn't work out like I thought. One of Freedom's, though, there's going to be a statue hidden in those. Or not a statue, a stairway. Hmm. Ow. I don't want to be possessed, thank you very much. Having only my own, well, I guess I have more than my own soul. <laughs> into that room. How many? Oh, and as I said, there's eight. So those eight laser beams. Oh boy. Oh wait. I need to... That's right. I need to go down this way first. Because that's the right way to go. Ow! Stop being lasers. See, there's the the chest. Oh, hello. How many hidden enemies are in this room, man? I think, uh, for the most part, we got them all. Okay. Yep. Now we can go through like normal. We're gonna take a lot of damage here. So here's hope that I don't need to use an herb. Shooting me! <laughs> what the? I held right! <laughs> Six more enemies, one treasure. The treasure is below us. Huzzah! But see, as I said, these guys don't actually count as enemies. Our last red jewel! That puts us up to 49, which means the final red jewel is in uh, Tower of Babel. The final dungeon. Four enemies. 
I know exactly where these four enemies are, too. Because they're annoying. Woo! They're right here. Well, two of them are. goes. Thank God you're an invincible one. You need to die. Alright. I wonder if I missed the health or not. Dang it, I need to go back into Wills too. You got the Hieroglyph Stone! All right, we're done with Will. Well, and once we go back, get Will's power-ups because I want that power-up because it could be my health. This needs to go in slot number four. Now all that's left are Freedom's two rooms. Whoosh. Not bad. We've made it through most of the, uh, well, four, uh, th uh what? Two thirds of it. There's a reason we still have Lola's flute, by the way, or music. Almost done with the gooping, though. Which is, thank God. <laughs> Alright, well. I gotta become you again so I can get the ear power up. Why'd you have to miss the power up, Will, huh? <laughs> I wish that there would have been, like, a door to take us back up or something. Sorry, what? Where did I miss the enemy? Up here. Up in this room. There we go. They're smart enough to put an exit here. Leave the spirit behind. <laughs> but this means we gotta turn into Shadow to turn into Freedom now. I'm excited. I've never gotten to do the bonus dungeon. As you can see, it's shifted between the two colors. I love how each one has their own transformation. But I still really, really hope I didn't miss a health somewhere. <laughs> if I did, I'm gonna be so sad. Alright, freedom room number one. Frieden, as you can see, those are switches. It's going to raise an elevator up and down. You can do this room instead if you prefer as Shadow, by gooping down here. I 
I really hope I don't need to come in here as Shadow, though. Because otherwise, it defeats the whole purpose of using Freed. Because there's a switch over there you can hit with Shadow. Which, I, I prefer if they didn't make it so you could go through as Freedom or Shadow. Kind of defeats the purpose of having, you know, the separated rooms. This one's pretty cool. You make it through this room by uh, pressing those switches and it'll raise and lower platforms as needed. That was a massive slowdown. It's gonna go one more. Nope. Okay, Shadow got invisible guys are dead. Yep. Now it's going to. This area has such good music. But I love how it just rotates between like three sections here. Ow. Oh. I guess there's four or five maybe. I don't know. I don't have brain power. Ow! Hey, attack up! But so far, that means uh, we're out of luck when it comes to health. So I may have missed the health up, which kind of sucks. Hey, right, well, freedom room one, number one down. You've got the Hieroglyph Stone! Number five. One more to go. Hmm, I'm really hoping that final health upgrade is in freedom number two. Or I messed up. Oh well. It's not that big a deal. It's one health. Goop time! Alright, goop. But like I said, I'm always- I'm going to choose, uh... The, uh, character that's meant for their room. I think I remember- oh no, I think I know where I left my health upgrade. Ah, crap. I think I left in Freegio. I think there's a trash can with a health upgrade. Oh well. I... Well, I'll find out, I guess. Now, the, this one's going to have uh, stairs behind some of these, like that one. You can see it right there. And down we go. Um, 
that's another staircase. But first... Uh, there's another staircase there! This takes us down, I want to say? Yeah. There's two invisible people in here. enemy and it's through that room we skipped. Of course it is. Uh -huh. Hey, we didn't miss the health up. Nice. Perfect. I was beginning to get worried. <laughs> and 28 strength. I don't care about the damage you're doing to me. I can take it. I'm a knight. I wish those jewels healed you. Like maybe for every hundred you just get healed. Because, I mean, not even, like, a big heal. It doesn't have to be all your health. Alright. Defense has increased, and that means we are done. That was our last power-up in here. And our last Hyro Blood. You've got the Hieroglyph Stone! Huzzah! Jump in. Alright. Time to put the last one in. Walk to the left without a sound. There, that's good. Don't move. I know the whole story of your adventure. I heard about an ancient biotechnology using a comet's light. I didn't know it was you. With the power to change body shape, you could get anything. People would bow at your feet. It's only natural that King Edward would trick you into this. My father? Yes, after all, that's the way kings are. He would do anything to get that power. He might even be more evil than a mercenary like me. <laughs> Stop it! Either way, if I make money, it's fine. Come with me to Edward Castle. A voice whispers in Will's head. Will, play the flute. Will. Well, I'm, uh, currently... Uh, don't mind me. I'm just gonna, you know, step down here. He softly played the melody he had learned from Lolo. Don't mind me. I'm just playing a song. And oh, damn! Wah! Oh, man, look how Kara Kara Jesus, dude's literally burning to death, crawling across the ground. Hey, uh. Will, why must everyone hate each other? I... I... Alright, you might want to get away from that body. I'm sorry, I got upset. You were doing your best to save the world. At first, I just wanted to find my father. But somehow, it got to be a trial. But me, I don't regret coming on this journey. Let's go and find the fifth mystic statue. Step all over your body. The melody you played became the Jackal's Dirge. I love this song. It's so pretty and sad. Um. Alright. Well, 
we're healed. Saved. And you know what it means. And his body's already... He puts the hieroglyph in the hole for the sound over the entrance. The mummified queen of the pyramid appears. It's battle time! The good news is... Oh wait. Wait, 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 wait! I can do this as well? I didn't know that! Shit! I would've went with Freedon! Oh well. I know this pattern already, so uh, it's actually easy. Oh! Unless I do that. Point. Ow! Hey! Well, I guess I'm badass enough to do this. Ow. Well, if I end up having to, uh... If I end up having to use an herb, it's because I was an idiot. Oh, come on. If I, It's because I'm an idiot and I came in here with it well. I kind of want to not use an herb. Oh shit, I can't even hit her. I can't hit her where she is. There we are. Nope. Come on up, please. And watch her, uh... This is gonna take forever. I think... Oh, I went way too fast there. Point. Ow. Well, notice her body's constantly degrading as we do damage to her. Oh, oh you! I can't hit her there. I can't do anything to hit her! You bastard! I didn't know I could come in here as well! I've made a fatal mistake! Down we go. Fuck! Actually, Will's invincibility can be useful here. This is actually, I think I got her in a good spot right now. Got her in a good spot right now. Okay, now I don't know how well this is going to show up on camera, but I need to hit the one that looks like that. Out. Oh, you bitch! Okay, I've got a way to handle this though. As well.
Yes, please keep doing this. Please keep doing this. Oh no! Ah, do I use an herb or do I risk taking a death? Death, I mean. We can do this. I don't need an herb. I am pro gamer. Watch me roar. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, well, I'm actually going to go in as Frieden. Knowing I can, um, choose whoever I want to be for this. I don't want to use Freedom. Or, I mean, I don't want to use Shadow. Shadow has a slight advantage in this fight because of his aura. Oh well. <laughs> do we count that death? Yes. Yes, we do. That was my mistake. I thought it would transform me when I got into the battle. I did not think it would, uh... Hey, excuse you. Are you already attacking me? I'm doing more damage as Frieden, aren't I? Yeah, I'm hitting her for two. Oh, she hits me for two. I actually can damage race her. If I wanted. Point. Come up. I've got more range as him, too. Oh, hey. Excuse you. Point. Up we go. And now she reforms and we smack. I said we smack. Yeah. Smack. Oh. Ow! Double hit me there. Ow! Damn it! Point. Up we go! Oh, come on. Freedom's got a much bigger hit model, is the, the biggest issue. I think that's why he does more damage in the first place. Okay, that doesn't count for it. Okay, good to know. Down we go. Whee! This is much easier. Your earthquake's out of here. dead. Uh, I'm so sad if I'd have just come in here as uh, Frieden or Shadow in the first place. Ow. Where is she? <laughs> just, if you want to just keep doing this. But we can. Bye. Killed him with freedom. Defeating the spirit of the pyramid has obtained the mystic statue. Well, we took a death. I'm so sad. <laughs> I heard a voice from the flute. The same voice I heard in the prison at Edward Castle. Will, you've done well to come this far. Father? I'm at the tower now. Bring the five mystic statues to the tower. 
The statue you've collected hold the key to the fate of humanity. Will, hurry, the comet is approaching. The voice of the flute quiets and disappears. It seems something terrible has happened that I, we don't know about. What to do? I was told to go to the Tower of Babel, but that little island. I hear Neil has built another airplane. It seems he's flying to the desert town. Let's go back there. Well, that's convenient. Uh, before we do that, I want to check with you. We should have 49, right? Yep. Okay. Um, sadness, we lost a life. Well, I'm not afraid to use my herbs now. <laughs> we, uh, we're probably gonna do... Talk to Neil here. Really? Do you have to go? Once you make up your mind, there's nothing can... There's nothing... That, once you make up your mind to do something, nothing can stop you. Okay, I'll take Will to the Tower of Battle and then take Kara and Eric to South Cape. This time the airplane won't crash. Good. To the Tower of Babel! Over Babel. And... <laughs> Eric's holding on for dear life. We'll be, we'll be there soon, Will. Say hello to your father for me. Thanks. I know you will make a great president. Eh, I guess I won't see you for a long time. When you've finished your business, hurry back to South Cape. Thank you. I'm glad we all made the trip together. On this trip, everybody found something. Lance met Lily and found his lost father. Neil decided to take over his parents' company. Kara started to really live and saw a world outside the castle. I'm going to excuse myself. Finally, I can go to the bathroom by myself at night. <laughs> Just like Eric. Kara hasn't said anything for a while. I won't see Will for a long time. I'll say goodbye to him. Hmm, right. We've reached the Tower of Babel. Okay, Will. It's your par is your parachute ready? Let's go. No oh, shit! <laughs> Why couldn't you land? I jumped out over the Tower of Babel. I hadn't been there in a year and a half. What's this? A second parachute? Did Eric fall off? Oh, I missed that completely. Alright, but with that, Escalites, we're going to call this episode here. The next episode may be our last one, so hopefully you have enjoyed. If you have, be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and remember, Escalites, share the love. Goodbye. Thank you guys for watching, and a huge thank you to my patrons. Without you guys, I wouldn't be able to make the content I do and do what I love to do. So thank you very much, and I'll see you guys next video. Goodbye.